What about tight end? Who are we starting? Brock Bowers against the Steelers. It's crazy, right? I mean, you've said this in the past too. Last year, Sam Laporta, number one tight end in fantasy football, rookie. This year, right now, Brock Bowers, number one tight end in fantasy football. He's a rookie. Now he has been held to single digits in two of his last three games, but he did have 18 points in two of his four. So this is still a guy who give you great numbers. He's got the Steelers this week. The Steelers have played two fantasy relevant tight ends. Jake Ferguson, Kyle Pitts. They both scored double digits. So Brock Bowers is going to be in play and Devontae Adams, of course, will not be in play for Las Vegas. And then Tucker Craft. Now I'm not, last week you could say I was chasing the points, but I told you to play him and he went off. 88 yards, two touchdowns, 24.8 points. And he's had now 42 combined points in the last two weeks. While the matchup might not be great on paper against the Cardinals, they did give up 20 points to George Kittle last week. And while Tucker Craft is hot, I continue to ride him because the tight end position, Lindsay, as you know, is a dumpster fire. Who are we sitting? Mark Andrews. Listen, I know he had a good game last week, but it was nine and a half points. Like, that's yeah. not that great. It's Mark Andrews. You know, and like Isaiah Likely was better. You know, Charlie Kohler got into the end zone last week and the commanders have allowed double digits to just one tight end this year. So their defense has been pretty tough on tight ends. So Mark Andrews is going to be a fade. And now this one here, you may think I'm nuts and I know you got to play him. Listen, I have him. I got to play him. Duncan Kidd has not been great this year. Through five weeks, he's been held to single digits four times. He's averaging seven and a half points per game. Like that's not good. And even last week where the Bills didn't have Khalil Shakir, he had 5.4 points. There's nothing that tells me Dalton Kincaid's going to have 12 points this week or 15 points this week. His ceiling might be eight. And while that's pretty good at tight end, it's not what we were hoping for when we drafted Dalton Kincaid. So I know you probably got to play him folks, but temper expectations.